Greetings massive. What a go on YouTubers. Welcome to another video as we talk about switches and how they function in my home network. I want to highlight the differences between the two switches and what those differences mean and how I use them. Firstly, a switch is a network device that allows you to physically connect devices like computers and printers. It also acts as a bridge for the devices, allowing data to move from one device to the next and allowing these devices to physically form a network. Now let's talk about the next switch first. It is called an unmanaged switch. That means there aren't any management features. It is simply plug and play. You'll see that the next switch has 24 ports. I do have quite a few devices to connect together. So I do have use for many of these ports. However, as I have mentioned previously, I have my devices arranged into two network segments. That's because I want the devices I've placed in a segment to be walled off from the devices in my main network segment. That would be for the reasons of security and performance. The next switch does not allow me to do that in the most effective way. That is where the 3COM switch comes in. It is a managed switch. It has a web interface that can be used to manage connections among my devices better. It allows me to group my devices into the two segments, achieving the walling off I've just mentioned. That works because of the VLANs, that's virtual local area networks, remember, that have been configured to the switch. On this switch, the VLANs are configured by grouping ports together. In my case, there are actually three groupings and so three possible VLANs when devices are connected. It is connected to two ports of the monowall device. Each of those two ports is connected to one of the port groups on the switch. The router is thereby able to manage the two groups of the devices as two separate network segments. These segments are the main LAN and the DMZ segments I've talked about previously. Watcher, did you find this video interesting or informative or was it entertaining? Here you do. Click the like button, share it with a friend, and go and look out for the next one. Bless up.